Hi, this is Mato. In this video, I will show you a game between Tigran Levonovic Petrosian and Ara Vinashian. This extremely beautiful chess game was played in Armenia in 2006. Tigran Petrosian had white pieces and he started with e4. Ara Vinashian played e5. Knight to f3, knight to c6, Spanish opening, going for the Berlin defense. Petrosian castled kingside, knight takes on e4, white to move. Petrosian played queen to e2. d4 is by far the most played move in this position. You have a queen to e2, knight to g5, knight takes knight, Queen takes knight, d4, attacking the queen. Queen to e7, d takes on e5. Knight to d4, forking two pieces. Queen to d3, queen takes pawn on e5. Bishop to d2, threatening rook to e1, winning the queen. Knight to e6, rook to e1, queen to d6, hoping to exchange queens. Makes sense, because black is a pawn up. Downside of this move is, the queen is blocking the pawn on d file. Of course, Petrosian doesn't want to exchange queens. He is intending bishop to d3, and after black castles kingside, queen takes on h7, check, mate. Bishop to e7, Bishop to d3, c6, of course, black would love to castle. But then queen takes on e7, checkmate. So you have c6 intending queen to c7, d5. Knight to c3, queen to c7, white to move. What is the best move for white in this position? Hmm? The best move is the one played in the game. This is an excellent move. g6, g4, all out attack. However, f5 would be very strong too. We have g4, not concern for his king's safety. Black castle kingside. f5, attacking the knight. Knight to g5. Attacking the queen. Queen to e3, attacking the knight. Just kidding. Bishop to f6. Why bishop to f6? What is the purpose of this move? The purpose will be revealed soon. Rook to f1. d5. The move black wanted to play for a long time. Pawn takes pawn on g6 d4, forking two pieces. Now you understand why black played bishop to f6. White to move. Petrosian played in between move, check. King to g7, queen to e1, d takes on c3. Black is better materially. But that is not enough compensation for a very vulnerable position of the black king. Bishop takes on c3, queen to b6 check, of course, black considered bishop takes bishop, then queen takes bishop check, f6, and now black has a problem. Can you see the best move for white? The best move is rook takes on f6, rook takes rook, and then queen takes rook, check. King takes queen, pawn is pushed and promoted to something like queen winning for white. So we have a queen to b6 check, king to h1, bishop to d4, queen to h4 attacking the knight. Not joking this time. Knight to e6, 
way to move. This is the most interesting position of the game. I will not even ask you to pause the video and to try to find the move because the move is so amazing, so unbelievable. It's extremely difficult to find that move. Perhaps there is more than one way to win. But the way Petrosian chose to win, it's just amazing. Queen to f6, check. Move of a genius. Bishop takes queen, what else? Bishop takes bishop, check. King to h6. Before Petrosian sacrificed the queen, he saw this position in his mind's eye and he knew the follow up. Can you see the best move for white now? Petrosian played rook to f5, threatening rook to h5, checkmate. But now, Ara, Minashian played knight to g7, taking control of h5. Did Petrosian overlook this move? What now? What would you do? Please pause the video and find the best move for white. What did you find? Petrosian played rook to h5 check, ignoring the knight. Knight takes rook and now the obvious move, pawn to g5 check. What a game, what a game. What is the best way to describe this game? And let's go back to these very interesting positions. This is the first one. I guess rook takes on f7. If you found that one, that is pretty good move too. But this one is just amazing, queen to f6. And then in this position, Black played knight to g7, hoping to stop rook to h5. But Petrosian played rook to h5 anyway. Amazing. What do you think of this game? And that is all. I hope that you enjoyed watching this video. I wish you good luck with your chess and bye for now.